Hey everyone, here's a question from ratio and proportion chapter and the question here is find the equivalent ratio of 75 to 100 or 75 to 100. Now we know that equivalent ratio or equivalent fraction or yeah they can be found by multiplying or dividing the numerator and denominator with same number. You can either multiply them with any number or you can divide with any number. So here I'm going to show you how to do this. So one number I'm going to multiply and one number I'm going to divide here. Let's start solving. So the given ratio here is 75 is to 100. So we know that ratios can be also written as 75 upon 100, right? Now to find the equivalent fraction, what you can do? You can either multiply with number, but multiply the numerator and denominator with same number. Or you can divide again with same number. So first I'm going to show you how to divide with. Okay, this is a ratio 75 upon 100, right? Or Yeah, that's it. So I want to divide here with 5. Now why 5? Because when you're dividing with any number, that number should be divisible, both the numbers should be divisible. Like 75 goes in 5 table, 100 also goes in 5 table. You cannot take a 2 table because in 2 table, 75 doesn't go. Though 100 comes in 2 table, but we cannot cancel 75. So you should make sure that when you're dividing with a specific number, that number should be divisible. Both the numbers should be divisible. So I'm going to take 5 here. So this is equal to 75 divided by 5 and then again 100 divided by 5. So this is equal to when you divide 75 by 5 you will get the answer this will be 15 upon and this will be 20. So 15 upon 20 is a one equivalent ratio of 75 upon 100. Now here I have done division. So one more example I'm going to show with multiply. So when you're multiplying, this is interesting. When you're finding the equivalent fraction or equivalent ratio of any number, you can multiply with any number. But when you're dividing, like in this case, when dividing 75 upon 100, you cannot divide this number with anything. Like you cannot divide with uh, 7 or 8 like that. You have to make sure that when you're dividing with specific number, that number, both the numbers should be divisible there. Okay. Now I'm going to multiply here with 2. You can multiply with any number. So 75 multiplied by 2 upon 100 multiplied by 2. So this will be 150 and this will be 200. So 150 upon 200 is another equivalent ratio of 75 up 75 is to 100. So therefore we're going to conclude this. So therefore equivalent ratio of 75 is to 100 are I have just found two you can find it many so this can be written as 15 upon 20 can be written as 15 is to 20 and this can be written as 150 is to 200 okay yeah so it is our 15 is to 20 and 150 is to 200 that's it I hope it's clear how we have solved. In case in you have any questions or doubts, you can drop a comment below. Thank you so much for watching.